Hi and welcome. We're uh, going to open up a NGC submission. It's a Modern World submission. It's part two of the video that I did before. There's a um, world, old world submission. This one came in at the same time. So but it's a different submission. So we just figured I'd do it uh, separately. Again, um, this submission was split. Some of them are mine, some of them are a local coin shop of my, of, uh, that I use in near me, and um, we split the submission. So, um, the first one in this, uh, NGC considers anything from 1965 on to be modern. Last year it was 1950 on, but they've changed it to 1965. So, this is a 1966 uh, Taiwan, yeah, Taiwan, Chiang Kai shek. Came in MS-63. This is not mine. This belongs to um, my local coin dealer, but he included it in the submission. So, you got that grade on that from 1966. Next is a four-piece set. Um, we sent it in in the original packaging. It hadn't been removed from its original packaging. Uh, I had suggested conservation, but he didn't want to spend the money, so he got what he got. Um, so it's a 1980 Lake Placid Olympics. Not sure what Lake Placid is. The only Lake Placid I ever heard of was a big lake up in Maine with a giant crocodile that they made a movie about, but I don't think that's where they held the Olympics. So anyway, these are the Olympics from 1980, four-piece Chinese set. Got a proof 68 cameo on the Alpine seating. Next set, next one was uh, 1980 Biathlon. This one only got a proof 66. This would be where the conservation probably would have come in. Nice looking set, not something that I would normally collect, but he wanted the set. So, this one's figure skating, 1980, proof 68. And the last one of the four-piece set is speed skating, proof 68. So, we got three proof 68 cameos and a proof 66 cameo. So, overall, okay. The proof 66 kind of ruined it, I think. This was also his, a 1981 China Silva 35 Yon, 1911 commemorative. So it was minted in 1981, but it's celebrating the 70th anniversary of Xinhai Revolution. Anyway, got a Proof 69 Ultra Cameo on this. He was extremely pleased with it. I don't know anything about it. So... That's it. That's it for his coins. Me. I collect sharks. So, this was the Sydney Olympics 2000. Colorized great white sharks. Got a proof 68 ultra cameo. That guy was robbed. I don't see anything wrong with this coin. We got a proof 68, but. It's a registry custom set, so the grade really doesn't really matter. It's sharks that I collect. If it's a silver coin and it has sharks on it, I try to acquire it. And this 2021 Australia Great White Shark. Got an MS-69 on it. Great design. A shark coin. A third shark. Big fatty holder. 2017 Megalodon shark high relief. Silver two dollar. I believe this is a two ounce. That's why it's so fat. Proof 69 ultra cameo. That is also a top pop. There are no 70s. So this is an amazing coin. If you see it in person, it just jumps out at you. 
It's just got such a ridiculously high relief on that side. Look at that thing again. That literally is coming out of the coin. Really, you know, it's an amazing coin to see in person, but out of my shocks. Even prehistoric shocks. And the last one. Yep. These were really big in 2015, 2016. Gorilla shocks or gorilla Congo gorillas were everywhere. One ounce. Um, and they kind of died off. But they still make them. And I have a Congo registry set. That's the number one NGC registry set. It's really one of the only modern registry sets I keep going. Um, the rest I've kind of sold off and concentrating more on my ancients. So this is a top pop as well. There's uh, no MS-70 Silverback Gorillas. So let's get added to the set. And that's it for this pop, this uh, submission. This was a good modern submission. Um, so overall, I think I did pretty good. A few, uh, a few different coins that were submitted by uh, by my friend, dealer. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. And hit the like, subscribe. I uh, have an ancient, uh, ancient submissions due any day. It's got some really neat coins in it and um, some big disappointments as well. So some really, really rarities and some real disappointments. So hit the like, subscribe, leave me a comment. And if you like ancients, stay tuned for my next video. You'll like what uh, what I have to show. Thanks a lot.